Zach, thanks for staying with me last night, but honestly, I don't need a babysitter. I oh, know that. Look, um, do you fancy going into town before you catch a train? Just having a look round. At what? No, just get something to eat, maybe. You can walk me as far as the bus stop. I don't mind going to the station with you. I'll be alright. Zach, you've got to get over this obsession with Will. We've all got to live together. So, you're definitely going then? Looks that way. When we'd be back? A week, maybe. You heard anything about your laptop? Not so far. Criminal, isn't it? Can't trust anyone these days. No. You can't. Promise me you won't do anything stupid whilst I'm gone. Just stay away from him, Zach. Point. The password could be anything. Got any ideas? Mickey? I think she's right. I think this is a fake. What? Mercedes. I should have known some skanky student wouldn't have a designer handbag. Hold on. You told your sister that you nicked a handbag? No, I said I borrowed it from a friend. You do know you're going to have to replace that with the real thing, don't you? Now look, never mind that. What about this? Well, you said you had connections. Yeah, but without the password, it's just junk. And by now, they only would have called the police. What would you have done if we'd have got caught? Uh, hello? I don't get caught. Mm, is that right? <laughs> uh, no, I thought we were waiting. You know, for your birthday. Well, am I not allowed to take a sneak peek at my presents? Uh, no. We've got to get rid of this before Calvin gets home. Whatever. Morning! Jackie, please talk to me. About what? I slept with my husband. Jackie. Oh, go on, Alec. I would love to hear you defend her. But we just couldn't help ourselves. Right. So you just tripped up and fell on him. Is that it? I was thinking of you the whole time. And if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have passed that immigration test. <laughs> this isn't some uh, game, Carmel. Do you know what would happen if they worked out that, that you'd lied? Please, can we just sit down and talk this through? I could go back to jail. Go is that what you want? How can you say that? And I'm so not going to let that happen. What do you mean? Where are you going? Do you know what? I did this as a favour. I put my neck on the line for some bloke that I'd never even met with a sob story about how starving folk are back home. But you... You're so, so selfish. You couldn't care less about that, could you? Jackie, please wait. Hi, Tony. Yeah, um, sorry. Um, yeah, I'm just uh, heading into work now. Okay, great, thank you. What are you gonna do? Just keep your gob shut. Got that? Hiya. Go on then, who's round, is it? Well, if you give us money, I'll do it like work. Oh, right, well, I want change. What's mine's yours, sweetheart? Hmm. Do, uh, do you roll over when she whistles as well? Oh, sorry, mate. If I didn't see you there with your crowd of admiring women, a nice shirt. I'm say this choose that for you. She might have, yes. You know, it's amazing how they've managed to actually weave the female repellent into the material. What are you talking about? It's brown. So? So, she's marking her territory, making sure no females find you attractive ever again. Is that right? It's either that or pee all over your can't self lucky. <laughs> and how is your love life, my friend? At least I'm not the one wearing a poo coloured shirt. <sighs> can't kill to get it. Fine. Yes, but it's lost time. Yeah. Problem, babe? We've got to get tea and snack these and we're off. What, does it need two of us? You what? Well, I, uh, I, I, I said to Reese that I'd help him uh, with his revision. So, um, if that beer's going to spare, I'll, um, I'll have it. Fine. Then I need some more money. Off me? 
Unless you want us all to starve. Oh, what? Thank you. And don't go talking to no girls. Yeah. No danger of that. A hey, nice shirt, by the way, mate. Hmm. Isn't it? I chose that. Hmm. Cheers. <laughs>